Ani Mbuju Band Members, today is Monday, February 27th. Since last week, we have no confirmed cases, so no additional confirmed cases for COVID-19. District 1, including District 2A, 418, no new cases, 66, and District 2, no new cases, and District 3, no new cases. Health and Human Services and its outer district clinics will be closed Friday, March 3rd. Here in District 1, the Health and Human Services will be closed from noon to 5 p.m. In the outer districts, they will be closed, the clinics, from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Please be sure to make prior arrangements for prescription pickups. Road crews have been out clearing snow and ice packed roads and will continue to do so through today. I drove in from Hinkley this morning and coming out of Hinkley was glare ice. And the more west I got, the roads became a little more drivable. And I think the conditions will continue today. So please be careful out there with the rain turning into ice and the snow. Another reminder for February 3rd at the Old District 1 Community Center, there will be a fundraiser for the band's Family Healing to Wellness Court, and that will be fry bread and chili. And it costs eight bucks. You'll be supporting a worthy cause and have a good meal. So eight bucks is well worth it. District 2 is holding a family fun night at the Isle Bowl and Pizza on Sunday, March 12th from 3 to 6 p.m. The menu is pizza and beverages and fun for the whole family. McGregor will host a family fun night in April. And so when they provide that information to me, I will provide it to you. Mentioned this a couple of times over the past week, but the Corporate Ventures has scheduled the Springtime Elders Gathering, and that is Wednesday, March 22nd, beginning at 1030. And that would be at the Mille Lacs Events and Convention Center. All Mille Lacs Band community elders are welcome. Today, I had a couple of meetings. I jumped on the Minnesota Indian Affairs meeting that is scheduled at Lower Sioux. Sheldon Boyd, our secretary treasurer, is in attendance today. And in a couple of days, it's a two and a half day meeting. I will receive updates and can share those with you. Also, I had one of the board meetings and that was NAFOA. And there is a large convention that was scheduled in April. And this focuses on financial responsibility of tribes, very important very excellent convention conference that happens. With that, I think that is my news for the day. I will talk to you soon and be safe out there. Miigwech.